Just trying to hold things up, allow teammates to get inside 50. Now Ryder sees Dixon. May gets a body on him, but Charlie's got it. The man who kicked the Suns' first ever goal back in 2011. Stuck his bum into him at the right time and took an easy mark in the end. And the finish is pinpoint. Charlie with the opening goal of the night against his former club. Amon told to play on. Gray getting there. It's a beautiful kick to the advantage of Robbie Gray from Amon. Robbie Gray might fancy racking up a half century of goals this season tonight. He's only three away now. Around the corner, just eluded a Port Adelaide player, but swooping onto it. The pickup and the goal is spectacular from Houston. And just his second game of footy. Great scenes when his dad actually handed over his first jumper in the AFL last week, captured by Port Adelaide. That's a low looking kick. Dixon, one out in this goal square. Another one for Charlie. He's got a couple on the board. Wingard going with the casual approach. Did well. Applied the nice tackle though. Clever little kick around the corner to find Jake Need. He might have rolled his ankle here. Eventually wow. Need plays on and brings it back around the corner. Jakey Need with an inspired finish. Oh, Robbie Gray's got a one out if it gets there. A little shank, but Need runs onto it. Beautiful handball on the up. Westhoff in his 100th straight game in the AFL. Second turn. One more handball and they were out. So Ebert's tackle was full of merit. Now Pal Pepper surges his way through. The two Greys are there for Port and Sam takes it. So Sam Gray with an easy assignment right over the goal up by his hat. They've got another one, Port. Swallow goes back. Hanley wants it, but Wingard cut it out. Gets it back from Westhoff. Burn Jones. Wonderful kick. vision. Great option. They should kick one now. Got to give yourself a chance, though. Just a chance. Well, he's never missed from here. And he continues that record. He's got a couple now, Sam Gray. Mark Rashida. Dixon quickly to Wingard. Just chips it. To the advantage of Robbie Gray, he thought, but Saad burned him off. Oh. Is that holding the ball? He's dropping the ball. Oh, oh. No, a goss from nowhere. Came Saad back into the picture. Still alive here. Wingard will eventually finish it off. It had to come. Well, Sam Gray winds back to need squeezes a beautiful kick and sam gray just keeps getting his hands on an inside 50. had a bit more pressure had monfrey's playing better aaron oh, young nice. last year he's got three next to his name now sam gray spencer brought it to ground harbrow or may played for the free kick didn't get that one and robbie gray's got four rather sam gray Boat moved it on quickly. Ebert and Need could have raffled it. Ebert says, I'll kick it. And he goes the journey. Oh, ice on his right quad, so I think he is done and dusted. And for the season, of course, Gold Coast wrapping things up tonight. But their Neefel team did win. And another week, at least for them, through to a prelim final next week. Surely you'd get Wingard off and, and ice him up if he's got any doubt with that ankle, wouldn't you? Is this the percentage booster they're after? What a kick from Polak. They've got the margin now. A turnover or a neutral situation for a bounce down ball in like this. Oh, we've seen that before, and with the tap work to Gray. This time he finds Wingard on the lead directly in front. Maybe it's not too bad at all. So he missed two from the angle, did Wingard. This time directly in front. He's got one now. Take a rest for the final term, Chad. You've done enough. And kept on wrapping around the boundary line. Clever. And Hartlett, how well did he do to find yeah. Need underground? Hall. Marshall. He got there again. Oh, well done. With that vertical leap of his. As first round draft picks last year, so. They're loading up with some kids, aren't they? 
Sure are. Is this the moment for him? He's got his first goal in the big time now. Good boy. Todd Marshall, and they get around him. And 83 points the margin. They've got 100 on the board themselves. Goes all the way back to Polek. And Fiorini thought he was coming onto his right boot. Yeah. And that's why he allowed the space to open up to find Dixon. Steve, six or seven hundred kicks in league football. You think you'd work it out? <laughs> Good kick. Yep. Yep, they're not going to be reeled in now. Ebert looking for Charlie again. May trying to get there, but Dixon just plucks it in amongst two opponents. And he can go the journey. He's asking the man of the mark to go back to 48 out. In the earlier game, and Dixon fancies doing the same here. Pulled the kick. Or did he? He's shaping it back. He's got two in a minute, Charlie Dixon. On a nudge Saad out of the way, and he left it behind for Need. Kept it loaded, Jake Need. Spencer. Hall. Kept it out in front of himself, then turned it over. Sam Gray Been had high. his head taken off, and he can go back and kick a career best fifth for the night. Rose, a quarterback, did he stay 20 metres back off the pack, back off that contest? Comes around the corner, and Sam Gray does have a high five for the first time in his career. Lead by 100 plus as Polek goes through the gears again. Wonderful handball, right? To Hartlett, who lowers the eyes and finds a teammate. <laughs> could have six. He's going to have six. From directly in front, Sam Gray. And Hartlett saying, if you left it, I might have got it. I think he might request a copy of this game. <laughs> His old man will be absolutely stoked. He comes to every game. with a penetrating kick. Looking for Marshall to rise. Off his hands to Dixon. Palming away from a couple. Gets a little banana going in. Boak read it well. Wingard keeps it moving. Jakey Need always popular when he gets a major. 